what? <laughs> I mean, I'm speechless. All right, so last week I had 7,000 followers on TikTok. Now, one week later, I have 329,000 followers, 2.4 million likes. And this video here that I posted last week has over 9 million views. I mean, <laughs> it's so hard for me to comprehend this. I mean, what? Anyways, in this video, I am gonna break down everything that I've learned through posting on TikTok every single day since September 2019. I'm also gonna like spectaculate and share my views on why I think this particular video like a blue, I mean, 9 million views. <laughs> I'm just, wow. I'm gonna, you know, share my thoughts on why I think it blew up. And in the end, I'll talk also a little bit about what I think you can do so this can also happen to you. So, before I forget it, if you could smack that like button for me, it would really help me out. You know, consider subscribing and sit back, enjoy, relax. We are gonna dive deep into this and let's, you know, start this video. All right, so as I said, I started posting videos on TikTok in September 2019. That was around the first time I heard about the app and I was like, hey, I wanna try this out, let's see what happens. So I started posting like every single day, sometimes two times a day. But before I get into all that, let's back it up, you know, uh, four years. Four years ago, I started to post consistently on social media and made my first YouTube channel. That was a magic channel. I was striving to become, you know, a professional magician. I was like a semi-professional at the time. I was working as much as I can and I made a YouTube channel to promote myself. And in that process, I got obsessed with a new type of hobby, which is creating videos, cameras, photography, and all that stuff. And eventually I created this channel you are watching right here, starting to get a job as a photographer and videographer, and just this started to took, take off. And also in 2016, the same time I made my first YouTube channel, I made an Instagram, and there I've been posting consistently for four years now. Never have I had any type of big success, no, nor on Instagram or on YouTube. I mean, it's very hard, there are so many people here. I think the most views I had on a single Instagram video is like 2,000, and here I had like one video with 60,000, and then another with like around 100. That's about it. I heard about TikTok in t September, and I was like, hey, this is a new app. Because one of the you know reasons why it's hard to get noticed on the older platforms is that there are so many people there. So I was like, if you are first on a platform that's, you know, <laughs> then it's like good. So I started to post there, but I wasn't seeing any real success. You know, it was much more views than I get on after this many years on YouTube. You, if you post a video there, you're bound to get like one around thousand views at the moment. But still, you know, <laughs> still, you know, to be honest, I was I've been posting I don't know 100, 200 videos there, and I was starting to think like this, this, this will never happen. <laughs> really, I'm gonna create a separate video where I talk about the differences in growing Instagram versus TikTok. So this is not gonna be the whole story. But just wanted to to share this because later on in the video, I think we can look at this, and it would become a little bit important when I talk to what you can do. So. <laughs> Last week, I posted this video. I've been posting a lot of different stuff on TikTok. I started with just chopping down drone shot. And after watching a little bit how the platform works and trying to learn a little bit of what happens in my niche, I decided to go for it and just post this video. I'm gonna show it here. This is not with the original sound, because then I will get copyright claim. So if you wanna watch the original video, head over to my TikTok, watch it there, then you can see with the sound that is. But here I just, I, I choose a random sound from Epidemic Sound and, and chop it down the video. Let's watch it. <laughs> All right, so that video blew the f up. I mean, over 9 million views, still counting. It's still getting a bunch of views, still getting a bunch of followers in. Before I talk about why I think it blew up, I want to break down a little bit to you what TikTok is. If you don't know, if you're new to the platform or you know maybe you have no idea what the hell is TikTok, you know? Now TikTok is a social media platform in short video form. It's very similar to Instagram, which I, I <laughs> you know what Instagram is. But instead of having pictures, it has videos. Now, why did this video do so um, good? Now, I think, you know, I, I'm not one, <laughs> I can't like pinpoint one specific thing, but like, if you watch my earlier videos, like all the way from the beginning, I was posting mostly uh, lots of drone shots, not so very personal videos. They were not looking at, you don't, I didn't, wasn't showing, you know, me or anything. I was just posting a bunch of different videos. Um, 
Some of them, the best one did like almost 400,000 views, which is very good, but it didn't generate that many followers. And I was still, still trying to learn, you know, what works. But on all this time, I, I stay and I, I look at the platform. I am like, okay, what, what are other people doing? And one thing I saw that like people are like showing themselves and then they show their work. So it makes it a little bit personal. <laughs> Let's turn on the, uh, this again, you see? Like this, I think this looks beautiful. Now I can't, you know, straight like pinpoint why did that this video went viral and I can't like like with when people things go viral, there's a lot of luck involved. That's just you know, that's just how it is. Else everybody will would be viral. But I honestly believe I don't really believe in luck. I believe that you can position yourself to become lucky by posting more often, to being there at the right place at the right time, to like really position yourself to become get a viral moment or lucky or whatever else you are doing in your life. I'm gonna come back to that later. Now, with this video, I'm showing myself, <laughs> I'm handsome, you know, yes. And then I'm, I'm, I'm also, I write there that I'm just a regular guy. I'm not famous or anything. I think that that sentence really, like people can, people can really, you know, relate to that. We are all just regular people. Most of us are not famous or anything but we want to be recognized. We want our work to be recognized. And, and then I did a little yet there. And I think that that's a key sentence for this particular video, because people can really relate to being in that position. And then I show some, I show bangers. Like these photos are top notch. I'm not to brag or anything. I know it's my own work, but I don't think I have to be humble here because these shots are amazing. Like there's two in the beginning, definitely a few of the best photos I've ever created. And when I think the people on TikTok see this and they're a regular guy and like, boom, I think they can see themselves also there and it just starts to take off. And then the luck comes into place because also you need luck there because I think for things to be viral, a lot of people would have to see it at the same time and had to, had to get, you know, that viral. It just spins out of control and into like virability. And at the time, I'm not kidding you, this was insane. I've reset it, I, I was now uh, scrolling, uh, what did it call? I was like, you know, refreshing. I was refreshing, refreshing, and it was a thousand more followers, thousand more followers. It was, <laughs> it was the most, it was the sickest thing ever. Like I've, uh, like I, I've posted so much on social media. I've never had this before. I've just, I've dreamt about this. I've visioned it. I've like been like, this is gonna happen to me. I've like, there's so many times where I've been like, this is never gonna happen. I'm like, you know, cause it's, like, it's so crazy. And then it's just boom. <laughs> that was, that was, in, that was insane. So to summarize why I think this particular video went, you know, just boom all over the place. It's because I'm just a regular guy that people can, you know, relate to that could take a lot of good photos. And then with the luck that is involved in my other videos, this video just boom, took off. Now, a thing that is cool to mention here, I also got a lot of followers from this. I've seen a few other videos go on like boom. Uh, I saw one guy who got like 22 million views of a single video, but he didn't show himself. It was not personal at all. And I think like he has, around 100 and something thousand followers. I can't remember who he is right now, but I was looking at it and he got way more views on, on, on his particular video, but less followers. And I think the reason that a lot of followers and a lot of you guys started to follow my TikTok account was because you had someone to follow. You saw a face, you saw me, and you wanted to follow me and you wanted to see what I was doing. So making things personal, if you're like looking for gaining, you know, followers, I think, I think people want to follow people. People want to follow people they like. So I, I was super likable there. I, I was just, it was just such a random video too. I was just hanging, I was helping my father. I was in his house uh, He we went through a knee surgery and I was just like, put the camera up and I was like, okay, I'm just gonna like, just, just test this out. <laughs> and I had no idea and, and few, it didn't take off right away, but few, like two days later, I was like looking at Instagram and I was just like, boom, 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 bunch of, of uh, Followers are like, where does this come from? Look at my TikTok and oh, 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 oh. All right, so enough of about this. How, what can you do to make this happen to you? Honestly, and what I think is to position yourself. That's the number one thing that, like what I believe in getting, you know, any type of success, whether you want to have a viral video or not, is to position yourself to make it happen. Position yourself that luck can come to your way. 
You understand what I'm saying? For instance, on TikTok at the moment, there is there is a lot of opportunity because there are few creators and a lot of people watching, just like Instagram was back in 2011 and YouTube was before that. And by posting a lot of videos every day, two times a day, three times a day, four times a day, you're increasing your odds. Another thing that changed everything for my, me and, and on TikTok, you know, is that I was, I'm constantly on the platform and I started to notice what like works. So I'm, I'm like, you can't do the same thing on YouTube, you do on TikTok, you do on Instagram, you have to be different and then you have to see what works in your niche. So really like diving down into the platform and, and seeing what, what's happening in your niche, how does videos, like what videos perform well and then replicate that and put your own twist or whatever, you know, just look at the platform, what is working and learn and then start catering to that. I think that was like a, a huge thing for me. And also that I've been posting so much on other platforms and I've been doing this for like a long time. That also helps now because then I'm able to create good videos that I wouldn't able, have been able to do if I hadn't had the skill set. In the future, there will come other opportunities, other apps that's just bound to happen. So I think to just get down to work and start, you know, producing content or whatever is you want to do. So to summarize, how can you get a viral video? I think it's just to learn to see what happens on your platform, be yourself, I think that's good, and find things that people can relate to and they just create awesome content. It has to be cool. I think, th think people like you know entertainment and they like information and they like that ah moment. And I think this had a little bit of ah moment because I've just said I was a regular person and then show this extra, extra, extra nice pictures. Also people could resonate because they like, I was uh, <laughs> I was very like uh, cute in that video. I had this, I don't know, I did that. <laughs> some type of smile uh, so I see a lot of common people like wipe check on check so uh, so yeah being relatable I think is that all I'm basically just rambling I I'm not a scientist or anything I'm just like I've been thinking about this for last week and <laughs> this is honestly what I I think but uh, Tell me your thoughts. Are you on TikTok? Let me know in the comments down below. If you have any questions, as always, feel free to ask in the comments down below. I'm gonna put a lot of time and effort into this channel. I hope to grow it to 100,000 before the end of this year. That's a big goal, I don't know. Uh, but I like big goals, cause that makes me go, go, you know, that's, that's, that keeps me going. So, thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next video. I'm out there, peace.